Mika. Hi, I'm Stevie. Hi, I'm Diane. Hi, I'm Ainsley. Hi, I'm Mary. And, and together, together, we're High Five! <laughs> Woo! Woo! Hello, friends, and welcome to the High, high five, five House. Do you like getting together with your friends? Yeah, for celebrations like a birthday party. Well, you don't even need a reason. It could be a play date. But where are some of your favourite places to hang with your friends? Well, I love heading to the zoo to see all my favourite animals. <laughs> <laughs> Well, my favourite place to hang with my friends is right here in the High Five House. Aww. Yeah, it's the best place to play ever. <laughs> well, what are we waiting for? Let's explore... Play Dates! Oh, hey, chats. Can you help me with something? Sure. What can I do for you? Well, I want to take my little cousin Zach to the zoo for a play date. And I want to write a very special invitation. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to the zoo for a great play date. Oh, I'm going to the zoo and I just can't wait. A zoo that's full of animals, I want to see them all. At the zoo, my cousin and me, we're gonna have a ball. <laughs> now, I'm not sure what I should write on the invitation. Any ideas? Okay, a zoo play date. You have to tell your cousin all the important information. Like, when are you going to go to the zoo? Oh, next Saturday. OK, Saturday. Write that down. OK, Saturday. And write down what time you're meeting at the zoo. Nine. Oh, nine's a fine time. Hey, nine, fine. They rhyme. <laughs> oh, they do too. <laughs> oh, and what are you going to do when you get to the zoo? Hey, to do zoo. They all rhyme too. Chats, you're a poet and you don't even know it. <laughs> oh, I know it, Tanika. Poetry is one of my many talents. Oh. In fact, why don't we write your zoo invitation in the form of a poem? A rhyming poem invitation. That's a great idea. Dear Cousin Zach, how are you? I would like to invite you to the zoo. Oh, this is good. You and zoo. Good rhyme, Chats. Oh, I'm just warming up, Tanika. Next Saturday, meet me at nine and bring an umbrella in case it's not fine. Nine fine? Yeah, that rhymes. Perfect. I think we're finished. Aren't you going to mention the monkey? Oh, OK. I really hope we see the monkey. He's super hairy and really funky. <laughs> monkey funky. You're just a wizard rhyming, chats. The poem invitation is complete. <clears throat> Read it back to me, Tanika. OK. Dear Cousin Zach, how are you? I would like to invite you to the zoo. Mm -hmm. Next Saturday, meet me at nine and bring an umbrella in case it's not fine. Mm -hmm. I really hope we see the monkey. He's super hairy and really funky. Poetic <laughs> genius. Oh, I'm going to the zoo for a great play date. Oh, I'm going to the zoo and I just can't wait. A zoo that's full of animals, I want to see them all. At the zoo, my cousin and me, we're gonna have a ball. Thanks for your help, chats. That's what friends do. You're going to have a wonderful play date at the zoo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a postie on wheels and I've got things to deliver. I'm as good as skating postie. I'm zooming down the street. I'm as good as skating postie with a wheelie. Now, face the right direction and carefully scoot to the next mailbox. The postie's on her way! I'm a scooter skating postie, I'm zooming down the street. I'm a scooter skating postie, with the wheelie wheels underneath my feet. I deliver all the mail, as speedy as can be. I'm a scooter skating Special delivery! Oh, good day, and welcome to Stevie's Doggy Play Centre, where all the doggies love to play. Oh, 
I just better check which doggy friend is coming to visit today. It's a tiny chihuahua and her name is Pinky. Well, I better find some doggy things for my new friend Pinky. I got a doggy play center where the doggies, they all play. Yeah! I make them feel so welcome when they come here for the day. With a yippity yip and a woof woof woof, they're having so much fun at Stevie's Doggy Play Center. The doggy's number one. Cool. So I've got some doggy things here ready for my new friend. Now, I'm only guessing, but I think Pinky's favorite color is pink. So check out what I got. I have a nice pink collar. And it's teeny, teeny, tiny. Perfect for a little chihuahua. And it comes with the matching pink lead for when I take Pinky for a walk. Oh, and over here, I have a nice round doggy bowl. And you guessed it, it's also pink. Oh, and finally, when it comes time for Pinky's playtime, I have, <laughs> yay, it's a pink squeaky toy. Oh, Pinky should be arriving really <coughs> Oh, I just got an email. Do, 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 do. Oh, well, it says that Pinky's bringing along a friend for a play date. His name is Sam, and he's shaggy, and he's enormous, and by the looks of it, his favorite color is green. Well, green? I've only got pink things here, and, well, they're all for a teeny tiny chihuahua, not a huge, ginormous sheepdog, and, well, they're almost here. Okay, Stevie, you can do this. I got a doggy play center where the doggies, they all play. Yeah! I make them feel so welcome when they come here for the day. With a yippity yip and a woof woof woof. They're having so much fun at Stevie's Doggy Play Center. The dog is number one. Alrighty, so I have an enormous green collar and lead. That's for Sam. And I have over here a nice, round, big doggy bowl for a big dog appetite. And finally, I have a bone for playing fetch. And it's green too. <coughs> oh, well, that sounds like Pinky. <coughs> and that sounds like Sam. It's going to be a busy day here at Stevie's Doggy Play Center. <coughs> I've got some friends coming over for karaoke today. You know, I'm kind of known as the karaoke king around here. Whoa! Now this is how it works. You select a song on my fabulous karaoke machine. The music starts, the words come up right here, and you sing. Hey, hey, now here's the thing. You've got to groove with the karaoke king. Here's a machine that makes you sing. You listen to the music and you read the words, and soon you'll be singing the best song anybody's heard. I really am the king. <laughs> Yo! Hey, here come my friends. It is the king, hello! <laughs> K -k 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 king, it's got real guitar. My friends like very different kinds of music. Diane, she loves opera. La 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 la! And Stevie, he likes rap. Yo, rap's the best, yo, forget the rest, yo. As for me, the karaoke king, well, I'm a pop music kind of guy, but luckily in karaoke, there is room for all different types of music. So let's try this out. Rap and opera. Take it away, guys. Hey, hey, yo, here's the thing. Move with the karaoke king. Here's a machine that makes you sing. Listen to the music, then you read the words. And soon you'll be singing the best song anybody's heard. Yo! <laughs> Opera and rap together. Yes, but I would like to sing with the king. Yo, I'm down with that. 
You mean you want to try three different musical styles in the one song? Yes! Well, why not? The karaoke king loves to sing with his friends. Now, let's put this all together. Rap, opera and pop. Hey, hey now, here's the thing. You gotta groove with the karaoke king. Here's a machine that makes you see. Listen to the music, then you read the words. And soon you'll be singing the, the best, best song in your body's heart. heart. No, no. The karaoke king really does bring people together, no matter what your groove is. <laughs> La! Yeah. to a great puppet show and now I want to put on my own show with two puppets a king and a queen oh the queen's lost her crown must have fallen off in the cupboard chop chop king huh. found it okay now the queen has her crown back thank goodness you found your crown your majesty I just didn't feel quite the same without it I love playing with puppets Cause playing with puppets is fun I can make them talk or wear fancy clothes Cause when you're playing with puppets You're always putting on a show <laughs> I've just got one more thing Chop chop! The sun! Where did the king's crown go? Oh, the king can't go on stage without his crown. Good job! Oh, I can't find his crown. Hey, where's his cloak? Oh, the king doesn't look at all like a king now. Chop chop! What was that? Hey, a hanky? Oh, it's got a pretty cool star pattern on it. Maybe the king could wear it. Okay, I'll just put it around him and tie it up. There, it makes a great cloak. <laughs> oh, I think we've got a new character in the puppet show. He just needs a hat. I love playing with puppets. Playing with puppets is fun. I can make them talk or wear fancy clothes. <laughs> Ta-da! The king has turned into a wizard with a pointy cone hat and a cool starry cloak. Oh, lovely to meet you, Mr. Wizard. Oh, hello, Queen. Yes, let's get on with the show. <laughs> Come on, let's get ready for the show. All right, Queen, in you go. Cool. Hey, guys, come see my puppet show. <laughs> I'm Mary, String Puppet Queen. Please be seated. Welcome to the palace. I'm the queen, I'm very grand. I am known throughout the kingdom. 
once three friends, a beetle, a grasshopper and a caterpillar. And they just love to play together. <laughs> Can't catch me! You're it! You're it! Oh, no, I'm not! You're it! Huh? <laughs> I'll chase you if you chase me. We'll chase each other and the pretty daisy. You race me and I'll race you. Racing and chasing is what we do. <laughs> what the three friends didn't know was that while they played, they were being watched by a scorpion. Gee, they sure look like they're having fun. I wonder if they'll let me play too. <laughs> Hi, my name's Barry. Can I play too? <laughs> it's a scorpion with great big nippers. It's a horrible stinger. Run for it. <laughs> and it was always the same. As soon as anyone saw his scorpion nippers and his scorpion stinger, off they would run. Oh, I wish I was a butterfly or something. No one ever runs away from a butterfly. Wait a minute, maybe I could be a butterfly. It was a crazy idea, but it was worth a try. So the next time the three friends came out to play, Barry was disguised as a beautiful butterfly. <laughs> what are we gonna play today? Oh, we could jump rope. Oh, we did that yesterday, but we could play some down ball. Yeah. Hi, my name's Barry. Can I play too? Wow, it's a butterfly. I do love butterflies. Me too. Of course you can play with us. Yeah! <laughs> and what a great play day they had. They played skipping, they played chasey, and they went exploring. This has been the best day ever. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> the four pals were having so much fun that they didn't notice that the sun was going down. It's getting dark already. How are we going to get home? Oh, I don't know. I can't see in the dark. Well, neither can I. What are we going to do? Well, I can get us all home. Oh, but how? You're a butterfly and you can't see in the dark either. Oh, yeah, right. Well, you know what? I've got some good news. I'm not really a butterfly and I'm actually a scorpion and I can get us all home. A scorpion? But I thought we were pals. Well, that was before you were a scorpion. Oh, but it's still me. I haven't changed. And I'm the only one that can get us all home. How can you get us home? I can use the stars to guide us. That's what us scorpions do. Come on, it's this way. In no time at all, Barry did what he had promised. He got everybody safely home. Yeah. We'll chase each other around the pretty daisy. You race me and I'll race you. Racing and chasing is what we do. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> and this time they really were pals forever. Now, how about another cool song? Race you! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs>